Hi guys, we're the Wolfmans and we are building our second dream home right across the street from our first custom home build. In our previous episodes, we showed you how we built the full structure of the house from the ground up and we are now officially in the sexier part of the build, which is the finishes stage. We've completed our flooring installation with tile and hardwood throughout, as well as trim installation with our baseboards, windows and door casings, as well as beautiful and unique accent walls in a few key areas using applied paneling. We are now moving on to the heart of the home, which is the kitchen. Since we live across the street in a home that has a very similar layout, we had a great starting point for our kitchen design. But the beautiful thing about designing a new custom home is that we get to improve on any area we want and we get to add new design features or apply the latest trends. For this new kitchen, we went with a more contemporary, clean design and chose a timeless white kitchen with pops of black for some drama and contrast, as well as brass accents throughout to add some warmth. So let's take you on site where the cabinetry is getting delivered. All right, kitchen delivery today. What's up guys? Back in the truck up, pretty excited. So we got kitchen coming, laundry room, mud room, master closet, other master closet, uh, master vanity. So we're pretty excited about this delivery today. Install starts tomorrow. Okay, first piece of our kitchen officially delivered. This room is going to be completely full by the end of the day of cabinetry. We are officially overrun with cabinetry and uh, installation starts tomorrow, can't wait. Okay, so we're jacking up the cabinets here for install. <laughs> Love it. I was wondering how you were gonna do this by yourself. Yeah, well, I had to think of something and that's something, so. <laughs> Genius. It works, yeah. Very nice. So it's uh, the weekend. It's been a draining week with all the coronavirus news and everything. It's just been like really overwhelming. We've just been feeling like mentally drained from all this news and yeah, that's everything that's sure. going on. But uh, the house project must go on. And the reality is for as long as the build is in progress, <laughs> we're paying money. So we have we gotta to keep it moving. We gotta keep going and we gotta keep um, making decisions so that we don't slow down the process. So um, we came over here. We had a we had a good idea of what we wanted for uh, the kitchen faucets, but we just came and we knocked that one out too. So we've yes. got both kitchen faucets decided. We've got our pot filler decided. And while we were here, um, we found a perfectly colored matching uh, hardware, hardware for our kitchen. So it's amazing. Like it's it's uh, sometimes really hard to try to match the hardware to the color of your faucets and especially with all these like brass and golds and champagne uh, different color tones that especially can be tough and we just found a color that matches so beautifully both for the hardware and for the actual color of the faucets and uh, the handles on the faucets. So we're really happy. Yeah, we're, this was like we're super stoked. productive. Hey guys, so kitchen cabinetry arrived and here you can see like they've started putting the kitchen together and it's looking amazing. Um, so we got the nice big uh, black hood over here and we're still gonna be adding a metal strip over here. We have to send that separately to a blacksmith to uh, create and try to actually match the color with the hardware and faucets that we've chosen. Um, and the profile of the shaker style is a little bit thinner than what we have now so it's a tad more contemporary the color is a little bit more white so it just gives it like a more crisp look uh, we've got a stunning um array i guess of all these like glass cabinets at the top which will be used for display and then one other like really neat thing that we created here is we've decided to make this long elongated open shelf which will be above the fridge and the two pantries. And it's gonna be like a cool display shelf unit. And we're gonna add a strip light underneath. And we just wanted to purposely kind of make it black to sort of throw in some of this contrasting black uh, pops of color. Um, this 
Over here is also going to have black doors and there's going to be a uh, glass as well with a black frame. And then we're going to also paint the inside of these windows black. And I think it's just going to be like a really pretty black and white kitchen, mostly white with uh, some contrasting black colors. So it's really coming together. So the kitchen trim and cabinetry is pretty much all installed. Now we just have to add some of the other key items like appliances, fridge, double ovens, countertops, and backsplash. And then there's going to be a brass um, sort of rim going around the bottom of the hood over there. And then of course faucets, sinks, and hardware. Still lots to do, but looks amazing. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Okay. No, no, stand that side. I'm just gonna go like this. Is that how it goes? Oh, you're right. No, this is the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let's see. One second. I like that sound. It's okay. It's good. Thanks for watching guys. We hope you enjoyed the video as we walked you through the design of our dream kitchen and showed you how it slowly comes to life. The kitchen is truly the heart of the home and more than ever, it is a place that brings the whole family together. So we can't wait to show you how this beautiful and functional space continues to come together. Please leave us a comment or a like to let us know your thoughts and be sure to subscribe to follow along our home building journey. In our next episode, we continue to unpack those boxes as we complete our cabinetry installation with our built-ins, master bathroom vanity, laundry room, and mudroom. So make sure to join us next time.